Fodder from Bill Armstrong Stadium. Indiana picks up their first Big Ten win on the season, taking down the Northwestern Wildcats four goals to one. Jack Edwards here on a brisk fall night in Bloomington. Indiana Northwestern unable to get the goals rolling in that first half. And it was actually Northwestern who drew blood first, scoring very early on in the second half, mirroring Indiana's earlier win against Butler. You know, the, the, the play, they did a good job of, of pressing in that moment. I thought BB gave Malone a tough ball and it kind of led to that breakdown. But that the, I think the message would be let, let's play in their half with like the first couple minutes and, and, and not concede anything. Um, so kind of lesson learned from that end. Well, let's break down the goals, five of them in this match. A thrilling second half, and it was a flurry of goals in the opening moments of the second half. Northwestern scored first. Indiana quickly responded with Quinton Helmer. Then Herbert Endeley took the lead for Indiana, scoring the second of the match. Following very soon after that, Carson Henderlong, a sniffer goal, as Todd Yegley puts it, getting one for his first as a Hoosier. The quick barrage ended, but Ryan Wittenbrink added a fourth goal on the match later on in the half to make it four goals to one. And Ryan Wittenbrink in particular missed a few good chances in the first half, but much like the team kept his head down through the adversity. Yeah, it feels great. Obviously not, not the way I wanted to start the game, but obviously my, my staff and teammates have the most confidence in me, so that really helps me a lot. And all my, all my teammates and I have confidence in them, so I think it's a, it's a really good bounce back second half, especially because you know, we've been right on the doorstep, but we need to start finishing goals, so it's a good, good sign that that started happening. And Carson Henderlund getting his first goal as a Hoosier. Not the prettiest of goals, but one that will help his confidence. And i just seen these steady strides, and, you know, I think tonight was kind of an accumulation of everything looking a lot more like, okay, here we go. Um, and he just gives us a physical presence. I thought his hold-up play was really good, and we need that element with our attacking rotation. And I thought his passing, his movement was good. It was a good night for Carson. Well, Indiana now has a 1-1-1 one, one record in conference play. Four total points in the Big Ten. The next head on the road to take on the Michigan Wolverines in Ann Arbor. For the Hoosier Network, I've been Jack Edwards. Final from Bill Armstrong Stadium, Indiana 4, Northwestern 1.